if they're in the mood for a little, a little danger. My name is Ryan Stock. I'm Amber Lynn. We're a couple, and we perform a danger act. I met Ryan when I was 19 at a festival, actually. We hit it off right away, and we've been together 24 hours a day, seven days a week now for almost 15 years. At our house, anything is fair game to go up the nose and down the throat. Ryan, what do you want for dinner? Ryan plays with absolutely everything. He essentially always is trying to make me smile and entertain me. <laughs> kind of binary. Either you like that kind of thing or you don't like that kind of thing. I think this could be the biggest opportunity in our lives. We need to nail this performance. The stakes are high tonight. If I make a single mistake, I'll be cut from ear to ear. It's extremely dangerous. Something can always go wrong. And the last thing I want to do is lose the love of my life. Oh, oh. <laughs> remember him? Oh. I remember him. How you doing? Oh. <laughs> We're already using our imagination of what part of your body you'll hang yourself on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you stepping it up? We're stepping it up. <sighs> Good luck. Now, I used to start every show by lighting a cigarette. These days, you can't smoke anywhere. So instead of a cigarette, I've got one of these. <laughs> now, this is a blowtorch. It burns at over 1,500 degrees. Now, for those of you who've ever seen somebody put a cigarette out on their tongue, we're pretty sure you haven't seen that person put out a blowtorch, and there's a really good reason for that. I call this trick putting a blowtorch out on my tongue. <laughs> A chainsaw. This is one of the most dangerous things I do. Ladies and gentlemen, we call it the chainsaw of death. Here we go. put them over your eyes. This next trick is not for you. This is a drill. Oh no. It's a real oh. drill. It's gonna put up his nose. No. Oh. Oh my goodness, he's Ooh. putting it down his throat. Don't stop me, don't stop me, don't stop me. Oh, it went all the way in. Well, first of all, I, I commend you for finding a, a partner that um, puts that puts up with you <laughs> grabbing a chainsaw by your teeth. This is almost, there's an art to this. I could go to Vegas and see this with music and the whole production and, and be entertained by it. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, it's really tough. It really is. I have such a hard time watching this. I really do. You know, I just don't want you to hurt yourself. I can't join the fan club. As much as people hate it, there are people that love it. There's no middle ground with you. No. I love yeah. that. The people are either hate it or they love it. And I think there's a place for you. I think you can make a name for yourself. I'm with the others. You're like a human horror movie. <laughs> and when I watch a horror movie, I do do this half the time, but I'm sort of compelled because it's so disgusting. This is going to be a tricky one. We're going to have a long conversation about you later, I think. All right. All right thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
I mean, that long drill down his throat. I mean, it's unbelievable. I think I'd go and see a show like that. I wouldn't. I, I, definitely, we, you'd sell tickets. I'm just happy that you still have a...